Welcome to Moo Moo Math and Science. In today's video, I'd like to talk about how to find the total surface area of a triangular pyramid. You know, this is a triangular pyramid because the base has a triangular shape, and pyramids are named after the shape of their base. Okay? Now, I have two things that can help you visualize and organize the data for the surface area. One, I have a grid, and in the grid I have shape, formula, substitute in numbers into the formula and area and it helps organize all of the numbers and then I have a net here that I will unfold for you so that you can see each side so let me go ahead and do that and you can see that this particular triangular pyramid is constructed of four triangles one two three four now the three on the around the perimeter these three will be the very same size, but this triangle in the middle is slightly larger. It has a slightly taller height. So let's just start plugging in our numbers and use our grid to organize it. So first, the shape is a triangle, T for triangle. The formula is 1 half base times height. For the base, the height is 7.5. Now it's not the height of the pyramid. It's going to be the height of the triangle is 7. 0.5, so it's going to be 1 half times 7.5 times the base you can see is 8.5. You can't see that, but the base is 8.5. Okay, and I'm going to multiply these together. So I have 8.5 times 7.5. That equals 63.75 times 1 half is equal to 31.875. Okay, and I measured these in centimeters, so area is centimeters squared. So now I have one done and I have the check. Now let's work on the triangles on the, around the perimeter, and they're all going to be equal. And if you can see the measurement here, I have a triangle, one half, base times height is the formula. If you look carefully, the height was seven centimeters, and the base again is 8.5. Okay, 8.5, and the height was 7. So now I go 7 times 8.5 is equal to 59.5 times 1 half is equal 29.75, and that is a 9, very messy, centimeters squared. So now I have 2. Now I need two more triangles, and they're going to be the same as this. So I'm going to go 1 half base times height. I'm going to substitute 1 half times 7 times 8.5, and that's uh, 29.75 centimeters squared. And I'll have one more of these. 1 half 7 times 8.5 is 29.75 centimeters. Remember, these are areas always squared. So now all I need to do is total all this up. I'm going to take 29.75. 7, 5 times 3, because I have 3 of these, and that's 89.25 plus 31.875, and that equals 121.125 centimeters squared, because surface area is always squared. So again, let me recap. Here is the triangular pyramid four triangles the one in the middle is slightly larger so here is the base here are the three sides total all this up for 121.125 centimeters squared i hope that helps in finding the surface area of a triangular prism thanks for watching and Moo Moo math uploads a new math and science video every day please subscribe and share